Hello everyone, and welcome back to Amateur Hour Projects. Today, we're going to take a look at the Tyrannosaurus Rex Wooden Puzzle by Wagumi Wooden Art. So the Archaeological Society of False Fossils has allowed me to do one more uh, project here as a probationary period, just as long as I don't break any more bones. So this is going to be a level 3 puzzle, ages 15 up. It's got about 110 pieces. So this looks like it's going to be fun. So let's go ahead and open it up. We'll take a look at what we have. All right, so taking a look here, these are very thin pieces of wooden board. I hope that these things are gonna be a lot more stable than I'm expecting them to be. So why don't we go ahead and start it up and follow along with the fun. All right, so Tyrannosaurus Rex or Terrible Lizard King. So, this was a lot of fun. I was very concerned with how thin and flimsy the pieces were here. And they were very flimsy. But, first thing we do is we start on the spine. Now the instructions uh, were not hard to follow, just a couple of pictures with all the pieces numbers. And luckily the spine pieces were all pretty much in order, so it wasn't difficult to find the next one. Now in order to seat the ribs and spine here, you do have to put a little bit of pressure into getting it to seat in there. But once it's there, it's pretty sturdy. I may have mentioned it in a previous video, but the Tyrannosaurus is my favorite dinosaur. And it does seem to be one of the most popular dinosaurs out there. Just like my last dinosaur video, I would love to hear your favorite dinosaur. Now we move on to the tail. As you can see, we did have to use both tail pieces there. I 
think it's to add more strength and rigidity to it. I was very concerned this whole section just because it was, even though it was two pieces, it was very thin. And you did have to put quite a bit of pressure into it to get the little spine pieces to fit in there. But I did my best to be very careful. Because, you know, we don't want to upset the society. Especially because they're giving me another chance here. And we're pretty much almost done with this tail. And then once we're finished with the tail, we... oh. Hmm. So yes, it did break. But I decided to keep going and just finish it. Luckily I had some wood glue from one of my previous projects. And later on, off screen, I fix it, just glue it back together. And last one here. This one broke too. Again, off screen, I just glued the pieces back together, set them aside, and they're just sitting there drying in the back. But for now, we move on to the head and jaw, and hope that the archaeological society did not see it. What happened? So the head here wasn't too difficult to put together. Just layering up the pieces to give it a more 3D in-depth look. And now the lower jaw.
I will say that this head section did feel a lot more structurally sound and sturdy and and I was less concerned about breaking something there. So I do like the way that they cut out the pieces of wood there. For the most part, all the different sections are together and in order, kind of as you saw the head bone there. And not just spread out wherever it fit. Although there are some pieces that are just put in randomly. makes it just slightly easier to put things together. And we move on here to the pelvis and legs. more sturdy feeling pieces. Now we put together his feet. And here, as the song goes, the foot bone is connected to the leg bone with cross-section joints. Pretty sure that's how the song goes. Now these leg sections do move, so you can articulate it a little bit and get the skeleton to stand up.
Alright, and now it's time to put the stubby little arms on. Which I think the Tyrannosaurus had just for show. So make sure you give him a little hand. Probably not very noticeable here, but that rib did crack when I was putting that on. And once again, I'm not using a lot of force on these, so they're super easy to break. I don't know if it's just low quality wood, or if it's just too thin. Thankfully it didn't break completely in half, it's still a little bit attached. But at this point we just finish assembling it, put the legs on, and here we prepare the tail. which I made sure to be very careful handling to make sure it didn't break again. Overall, another fun little build. finished Tyrannosaurus Rex fossil. I think it looks pretty neat. Now we did have a couple of snags and a couple of breaks there, but uh, if you don't tell the Archaeological Society, I won't either. We managed to fix them. So Tyrannosaurus Rex one of my favorite dinosaurs. I really enjoyed this. It was pretty nerve-wracking getting some of the, the pieces together because this was, again, very thin wood. It, uh, as you can tell, broke a couple of times. It was very, felt very flimsy. It didn't feel very secure and steady. But I still enjoyed it. I had fun, I hope you guys did. If you like this, go ahead and like the video. Subscribe if you want to see some more. Go ahead and let me know down below in the comments any uh, suggestions you guys have for any other videos, any other projects. And as always, I want to thank you very much for joining. Have a great day.